Um, so, so excited to introduce our next presentation, Helen Nuts. It's Chef Miyoko Scott and Chef Kamari Kiones. Um, a few things that I think about when I look at this, you know, I'm a vegetarian and often walk into the grocery store and I'm like, wow, this plant-based cheese has like 50 ingredients. What's this all about? So I am just so excited to hear what they have to say. Um, these chefs are multi-talented. They actually, Chef Miyoko helped start the first Black boys school in Oakland and Chef Kami learned to speak French fluently while in elementary school. Um, clearly women of, of so many talents. So thank you so much for joining us and please take it away. Welcome to our Nutty Buddy family. We are Hella Nuts, a Hella Vegan brand. Our brand consists of just the two of us with no staffing. I am Chef Mieko and this is Chef Cami. We manufacture ready to eat plant-based products and run a late night eatery here in Oakland. Next. There's a problem in the plant-based community and it is soy. Soy is damaging to our health and the environment and is helping speed up climate change. Here is the popular vegan meat substitute label filled with numerous unpronounceable ingredients. There are very few ready to eat products that are free from soy and science. Currently, vegan products lack relatability to urban communities of color and vegan products that are free from allergens tend to be flavorless. We are a brand that doesn't sacrifice health for flavor. Our products mimic flavors consumers can relate to while using whole, local, organic, based, plant-based foods. Our commercial kitchen is completely powered by the sun, and we are providing products that are free from allergens such as soy, gluten, and oil. Hella Nuts is a 500 square foot plant-based eatery here in West Oakland, California. Up to now, the majority of our revenue has come from the plant-based eatery. It is the heart of our brand. The eatery allows us to use R&D before manufacturing products. Our inspiration comes from what we miss and crave. We are a trustworthy brand. Customers enjoy seeing our ingredients on display and tasting our creative dishes. Next slide. <laughs> Pictured here are our prepared products. These products have been tested with our customers and are ready to move to the next phase of manufacturing. From left to right, we have our halibut made of celery root, our fried fish made of banana blossoms, our burgers made from beets, our juices made from hibiscus flowers, and our egg scramble and our cheesecake, which is made from nuts and seeds. Currently, we have products consumers can enjoy nationwide. Here's our most popular retail product. Hella Nuts Ground Walnut Meat Replacement is no soy, no science. It is sold B2B, B2C, and direct to consumer. It qualifies for the SNAP Food Stamp Program. The product is available in liquor stores and food deserts, as well as natural food stores. The product is conveniently pre-seasoned and can be cooked within 15 minutes. Walnut meat can be used for anything you would typically use ground beef or ground turkey for. Pictured here are a few options. Chili, shepherd's pie, and everyone's favorite, tacos. Here's my mom, Yako. She has a background in implementing full-service school kitchens in OUSD. In 2008, she began the nonprofit Imagine That Kids. One area this focuses on is nutrition. She is a recipe developer and nutrition advocate. This is Chef Cami. She's the head chef. She's impacted, impacted food deserts in Oakland, California, studied agriculture business and renewable resources at Louisiana State University, started the first garden at Inspire Charter School, and is for the earth and for the people. Next slide. Next slide. <laughs> We know, we know we can capture at least 2% of each market with the right help. Flexitarians are rapidly growing in the US. There are 121 million in our serviceable available market. There are 46 million black Americans in the US, many of whom purchase products they can relate to. 9.6 million vegans in the US struggle with cooking fast, healthy food. At this time, we wholesale our products to nine stores and we are available direct to consumer and through Amazon. Our top retailers are Besties in East Hollywood and Berkeley Bowl locations. Without any paid advertising, oh, sorry, next slide. Without any paid advertising, we have been featured in the following publications which helps our direct to consumer sales. We are flattered that PETA, the number one vegan organization in the US continuously recognizes us and our products. Thankfully, because of these features, our customer acquisition cost is only 97 cents. 
Within our first month of sales, we were approached by Trader Joe's. However, we had to decline the conversation because we don't have the capacity to provide pallets of product with just us two people. With one employee, we can produce 96 bags of walnut meat a day, generating about $162,000 in sales a year. With four employees, we can produce $811,000 in sale a year with just one product. We strive to provide jobs in our community that have a real impact on the world. Next slide. Our goal is to raise $1 million. We will use these funds for manufacturing facility, key hires, distribution, and marketing. We have looked into purchasing a manufacturing facility in an opportunity zone in California. This will ensure we reduce our carbon footprint. Overall, we would like to provide jobs and healthy resources for our community. Who's ready, ready to be a nutty buddy? <laughs> wow, amazing, great job. Um, I heard, saw the chat, everyone is starving. So we're all <laughs> gonna go have to like dive out and snag after this. And let's welcome back our investor panel. Hi, um, thank you so much. Well, I mean, you two are incredible. You do so much running an eatery, packaged food line, nonprofit work. Uh, it's incredible. I can't wait to try it. Um, but with that said, you do have a lot going on. Um, how do you spend your time? Um, and, and what are you most focused on these days? Manufacturing products. Yeah, manufacturing <laughs> products in the eatery. This is what we do. We live and breathe it. We don't have any help, so it takes up all of our time. But we're dedicated because we, we see that we have an impact on our community already. And people all around the country, within our first um, month of sales, we were able to get to customers on the East Coast and the South, um, just with dropping our visual online and social media. So it's really been great to see how many people we've impacted. Awesome. Uh, I really, I don't know how we did this during a lunchtime uh, <laughs> when everybody's hungry, but we did. Um, so I really appreciated uh, your marketing and how uh, relevant it is. It's such a unique uh, way of approaching it. And I loved the market slide, uh, just kind of s explaining what the market looks like uh, for folks. I think that was a really important um insight that you had. Um, one of the things that uh, I'm curious about uh, from a, a marketing perspective, uh, how, um, how, how much awareness have you created um, compared to how much demand you're seeing? Is it, is it completely a demand issue with the capacity constraints um, or uh, what other marketing opportunities are out there? Uh, we had, you could take advantage of with this money. <laughs> yeah, we had a whole um, billboard campaign that was supposed to come out as well when we started the product line. But because we saw how big the stuff grew just from advertisement from PETA and Veg News, like we couldn't keep up with it. And right now we've had to revamp and focus on shutting down the restaurant and just having manufacturing days. And that's led us to know that we need a manufacturing facility and, you know, reaching out that way. So we've cut back a lot on our advertising because we know that we just don't have the capacity right now to fulfill everything. All right. That was amazing. Thank you, feedback panel. And thank you, Hella Nutt. Um, great presentation.